Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, let us see how to implement XOR gate and XNOR gates using 2 is to 1 multiplexer. XOR gate will be having the functionality of A bar B plus A B bar as output. It can be written as A plus of B. If you look at the output, 0, 1, 1, 0 is the output for these kind of inputs. If we are going to implement that in 2 is to 1 multiplexer, the select line should be out of these two inputs. Any one of the inputs can be taken as select line. Let me take it as A. When A is my select line, when A is equal to 0, this 2 is to 1 mux is going to select this as output. When A is equal to 1, it will select this as output. So looking at the truth table, for A is equal to 0 case, A will be 0 in these two cases. When A is equal to 0, output Y is 0, 1. It is same as B you can see. B will be my output. So when A is equal to 0, the first input will be selected. So if I put B here, that will be the output 0, 1. So when A is equal to 1, the second input will be selected over here. I need to put the value here when A is equal to 1. You can observe the truth table. When A is equal to 1, output will be exactly reverse to B. Here it is changing from 0 to 1 and 1 to 0. So I need to pass B bar from here so that I am going to get the functionality of y is equal to a plus of b using the 2 is to 1 multiplexer. This is how we can implement XOR gate. Similarly, if we implement XNOR gate, XNOR gate will be exactly reverse to XOR gate. It will be having the output a plus of b whole bar. Means that the output you can see when a b is 0 0 output will be 1 and a b is 1 1 output is 1. In other two cases output will be 0. Again here by implementing it in 2 is to 1 multiplexer, I need to write the select line out of these two inputs. Let me take again A as my select line. When A is equal to 0, you can observe 1 0 is the output. It is exactly reverse to B. See in 2 is to 1 multiplexer, when A is equal to 0, the first input will be selected. So if I give B bar as my first input, it will be matching the truth table. Similarly, when A is equal to 1, the second input will be selected. When a is equal to 1, if you observe the relationship between output y and b, it is exactly same. So I can pass b from here so that the output will be a plus of b whole bar will be the functionality. This is how we can implement XOR gate and XNOR gate using 2 is to 1 multiplexes. Thank you.